Today, we're going to go through how we can use the advisor forms portal to generate a client fact find with all the client's data pre-filled from XPlan and how we can sync the updated client data back into XPlan within a few seconds. Let's start by logging into the portal and let's find the client we want to be able to send a form to. Once we find our client, we can see we've got forms that we've sent to that client or had them complete previously. But if we want to generate a new form, we can click on the send form button. We then select what type of form we want to send them. And then we unselect the sections that we want to be able to include for this particular form. So let's go ahead and unselect some of those sections so we can build our form for our client. Once we've done that, we can click on the form link, which is going to go and generate us a new form. So that goes off to XPlan, gets the pre-filled data for both the client and the partner. Now we can either copy the link and send it to the client, or we can press open a new tab if we want to be able to open it up and view it as the client. All we need is the token to be able to log into the form. Now we've logged into the form, we can go through and let's update some of the information as the client. We'll go ahead and add a new dependent. We'll change our income to 65,000. We'll update our credit card expense and we'll even attach our credit card statement. Let's skip to the end of the form so we could submit it. I have to check the box to accept the declaration and let's submit the form. The submission was successful. So now we can jump back into the portal, go into our client, and now we can see our form submitted. So now the advisor can come and review this data before they sync it to XPlan. So all of the fields that are in this view are completely editable by the advisor. So if they decide that the client's made a mistake, they can update that information before they sync it back to XPlan by just changing the field, pressing save. They can now go into their changes tab. They can see the fields that were updated in the form versus what's currently in XPlan. If they're happy with the form data, they can then click on the little iris logo, click sync, and that'll sync the data back to XPlan. Okay, so we've had a successful sync into XPlan. Before we jump in and check the changes in XPlan, let's have a quick look in our expenses section to make sure that our document got uploaded okay. We can see we've got a link there. We'll click on the document that was uploaded into the form and we can now see the attachment. So we're happy that the client uploaded the document into the form okay. Let's go and jump into XPlan so we can quickly view the changes that were synced from advisor forms. We can see our mobile number was updated. We can see our new dependent was added. And if we go into cash flow, we should be able to see that our salary was updated to 65,000. If you have any more questions or would like to have a more in depth look at advisor forms, please visit advisorforms.com.au or umlautit.com.au.